marked the official opening of Gibraltar's first maritime academy on board the world's largest sailing ship as part of a collaboration with maritime services company Viking Maritime. What better way to do that than aboard, aboard this Windsor cruise ship? The chief minister called the academy the vital key link, adding it will provide the much-needed academic and technical support to the institution and accommodation the Rock already boasts. Tourism Minister Vijay Daryanani expanded on that when he spoke to us. Gibraltar has strong maritime links all, all, all around the world, and you know people want to, to want to want to train, and, and we thought that the offering this uh, this uh, opportunity, having this uh, maritime academy, would be very important. The vice chancellor of the university spoke of how the young university was able to develop new, innovative, exciting, and cutting-edge programs that are industry relevant and of the highest quality. As a university, we will be able to contribute to ensuring that Gibraltar is seen globally as a centre of excellence in maritime. We already have great ports, we have a flag state, but the missing link, if you will, was the training, the education side of things. And with the academy and also the School of Maritime Science, we can provide both academic cadetships, which ultimately provide officers for um, the industry, but also ongoing technical training. Young people in Gibraltar need to see about going to sea. And I think we've missed that, as the Chief Minister said. They don't see a career at sea as, and I'm, there's too many seas there, but they don't see a career at sea as something they want to do. But I think what we've done here today is, in, is rekindled that. I think we've made young people think again, ships like this, they can sail as captains on ships like this. And we're going to bring in the new year people from Virgin Cruises here to train. So we have a whole um, itinerary or a whole dive for next year of training in Gibraltar. Really good. Has to be a centre of excellence. It's the right place. We're in Southern Europe. We're the UK. Is that right? Yeah, we're the UK. And it will work. OK, so as from January, every month of the year, we're going to have a basic STCW training. We're also going to do refresher STCW training. And we also have some working closely with the government and with the Gibraltar Port Authority, again, to develop bespoke courses for the local industry. And that's what we want to offer, <clears throat> to offer a platform to the industry locally and internationally to deliver courses that are relevant and will create uh, industry-ready students and that are industry-relevant for the sector. Um, we already have two cohorts, so we had a group of students that started last year. We have the second years that started this year. So that means in a couple of years we'll have captains and chief engineers that would have undergone all of the training in Gibraltar. They will be navigating the seas and training up new students, all of which will be coming through the university. So very slowly we'll be extending our training and university academy to the industry through our students. Guests at the opening included the Governor, Sir David Steele, government ministers and university staff.